I have been thinking and researching. And it seems like the fact that we didn't find nickel is actually by design. Uh, it seems like we have to use a very high tier machine that requires a lot of steel to build, a lot of iron to build. And we just, we don't got that. Uh, we really do not have that. And so to build this um, at all, we really need to get create going um, so that we can build the things that we need to blast iron into steel. So we need to use a bunch of iron to make a bunch of create things with andesite and then with create um and that sort of gives it its own mechanical power basically is what's going on and that uh that will allow us to blast iron through lava and turn it into steel without using any coal which is very nice um that's probably going to be the best way to get <clears throat> large quantities of steel otherwise it's going to be practically impossible to generate all of the uh, bone meal we would need otherwise to turn wood into charcoal. At, I mean, one log per charcoal is actually quite expensive when you consider four charcoal per uh, bar of steel. Um, <clears throat> but all in all, we need about 100, I guess just under 160 bars of steel to make the excavator, it is called. Um, and we would probably need some steel elsewhere in the build to make a couple other tools and we would need to find a location that is suitable as well it is actually a very immersive engineering mod i'm excited to get into it but um, we aren't going to find nickel by digging unfortunately uh, so because we need the steel first and because we need to get into create first there is uh this thing we need mechanical crafter and these mechanical crafters require electron tubes, which require polished rose quartz. Um, and if you know anything about quartz, then you know that means uh, we are going to the nether. Um, we can get this rose quartz here by mixing nether quartz with eight redstone dust. And that gets us a single rose quartz, um, which we then often want to polish uh, for create things. <clears throat> so... Um, we're definitely going to do probably a couple of dedicated create segments um, after this, but right now I think we're going to the nether. And once we, we need at least seven of these, but ideally way more, um, we'll have to see how it's going. But for now, let's, uh, let's gear up and, uh, and get down there. Gear up and get down there. So we're definitely going to need food. Um, let's bring whatever food we got. Got some wheat we can make into bread. That's always nice. Uh, that is not correct. All right, well. Oh, good. Some of our hemp has begun to grow. Let's harvest that. Nice. It'll grow further. It'll grow back up. <clears throat> so, we've got a very renewable source of spring there, which is quite nice. Verdant sprig. Don't know what that is. Now we've got a big stack of beetroots here. I think that's going to be some great food for us. Let's just take those and we'll nom on beetroots for a while. Because we want to have lots of space. Um, we do need a block, so <clears throat> let's just talk through some fundamentals. If you're not too familiar with the nether, um, some things that you definitely need include a stack of building blocks, which we have. Uh, let's actually, we don't have quite a full stack, so let's get a stack of building blocks, just in case. And you also want a stack of falling blocks, so I like to use gravel for that, because sand is a little more valuable than gravel usually. Um, but up to you. Honestly, we have so much sand, uh, maybe we should use some sand instead. 
But this is just in case you need to cross lava. Uh, you can drop sand into it and it will fall and fill things, um, which can make uh, traversing lava much easier. <clears throat> um, or I guess sometimes you just need falling blocks. Sometimes you need to make a pillar as well, and it's very hard to build down. Um, but you can pillar out from wherever you are and then dig down. Um, another reason you might want to use sand over gravel is that sand doesn't turn into flint when you dig it up. If you build a 64 block sand pillar, you get 64 blocks of sand back. So you can stay there for quite a while. Not have to worry about that. Um, it's a good one. Um, but yeah, you want a stack of food. Definitely want a bunch of food um, and a stack of falling blocks, stack of building blocks. You want a weapon and a shield. Um, I probably am going to die, honestly, <laughs> except that I can just teleport home whenever I want. But uh, I anticipate having to panic teleport at the end of this. Um, we do have quite a lot of iron. I would really like to make this into um, steel, but I think we need to be realistic and make at least um, some iron gear. Uh, in fact, why don't we make some diamond gear? You know, I'm level 25. Let's enchant something. We'll go do that. We'll use this diamond pickaxe and this iron we have to make a couple buckets. We'll go grab some obsidian. And that obsidian we'll use to make an enchanting table. Although I don't have um, a book, I don't think. And I need a book. <clears throat> Let me double check they haven't changed anything. Yeah, I need four obsidian, two diamonds, and a book. And now to make a book, I could get three paper and a canvas, or three paper and a leather. Canvas you can make from straw, I guess. Which is the wild thing. Okay. So I don't have that. And leather I don't have either. So I would need to actually look for this, but it would probably be worth it. Um, you know, eh, let's not worry about it. I'm not, I'm going to actually try to avoid combat <laughs> instead. Let's, uh, let's just make some iron armor and try to stay out of trouble. So I need boots. Oops. And I need a helmet. Okay. <clears throat> and this is actually uh, leather, but that fire protection is pretty rad. So I think I value the fire protection and speed more than I do uh, the max health. Or, I'm sorry, more than I do a little bit of extra defense. So we'll keep that. Found that in a, a chest. In, I think I might have found that in the uh, the ruined portal that I found before the stream. But, um, found that somewhere. I think I found that last stream. Quite good. Maybe it was in the, the boat. Let's see. <clears throat> so, done with that. And, oh no, actually we need a couple more buckets. We'll do that. This is the second time that's happened, that I've been able to see an enemy through a wall. I think that means it's like a boss monster or something. I have been too nervous to go investigate. Uh, maybe I should make an iron sword. Might be a good idea. Just in case I get stuck fighting. Oh, you know, I should make something with gold, actually. I guess uh, a gold sword. Or I could hold a gold bar. That would make the piglins peaceful. I should have made gold boots. Uh, 
Um, you know, I'll make gold boost just in case. If I get stuck, you know, it'd be good to have in a pinch. And, uh... <clears throat> Otherwise, I'll keep the iron boots on for the extra defense. Because, gotta have something gold for piglins to not be mad at you. Um, okay. I think we're good. I think we're good. Now, if you're wondering where we're going, there is some lava down here I ran into while I was mining. Somewhere off, I think, to the left. I'm not sure. Is it this way? No, I don't think it was this way. It was down here. Much further. So, let's go deep. There was lava some. We'll find it. Must not have been here. Oh, you know, I'm only at the one level. I think I was deeper. This was uh, <clears throat> some of the mining that I did before the stream. In this area. Oh, lava. Yes. This is what we're looking for. So I think there's a bunch of lava up here. Let's try. bunch of this skulk and lava. And that's just what we need. <clears throat> Ta-da! Obsidian. Sorry, just needed to uh, clear my throat real quick. Having a hard time with that. A 
Let's see, so... We definitely want... Oh, that's weird. Huh. Oh, I guess it grows on the block? Let's put out a lot of that lava. And bind up some of it. We could try to shapeless mine it. <clears throat> that would put all of it right in front of us. Yeah, let's let's hold to mine this. That's way faster than I thought it would be. Nice. And there we go. Tons of obsidian. Plenty of obsidian. So we can make a portal. There's also some skulk down here. Which I guess is going to gradually take over everything. Oh, I get XP for breaking it? Interesting. We need a hoe. Yeah, it's like a plant. Hmm, I hope it doesn't spread fast. we have acquired what we came for. Let's go back. Alright, so we've got some obsidian. I guess we need to go get a book, which means we need paper. Let's, uh, let's try to find it uh, somewhere with sand. Maybe a river biome? A river biome would probably work. Check the nature's compass. Oh yeah. Okay, well there's one not very far away. Where's the boat? You can make a boat out of obsidian, fun fact, but it does not float. <laughs> it is great for uh, the nether, actually, now that I think about it. Oh, I guess you can't make a boat out of obsidian in this version. <laughs> there are some mods which let you make a boat out of obsidian that floats on lava. Uh, pretty neat. I mean, it would still be really hot. I think it would be uncomfortable to ride. But, uh, you know, that's just me. Probably not just me. So, I guess I will make a new boat. Out of archwood? Or birch? I'm making out of birch. Boat. I left my boat somewhere, I think. I forgot to pick it back up. <laughs> Get in the comments. Tell me where I left it. Maybe you uh, remember the coordinates or something? Somewhere in the last episode, I left my boat. Okay, let's go find that river. You can see we uh, have the compass in the bar. If I turn, it rotates to tell me where to look. We just want to be going in that direction. You can see the distance up in the, uh, the top. If I switch off of it, it goes away. That's just when you have it selected, it's there. But even if you don't have it selected, it'll still update when you turn, which is pretty cool. little hungry. Whoops. Sorry about that. 
But, uh, maybe just turn down my refresh rate when I'm playing Minecraft. So avoid that. Don't want to, uh, I don't know if that's like an epilepsy warning or something. I guess also get in the comments and let me know about that. I don't know enough about it. Oh, wow, we found, um, we found sugarcane right away. That's fantastic. Uh, can I, can I please get out of the boat now? There we go. Sugarcane. So that's one page. I guess three pages? Is that? I don't actually know. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, so that's enough. Um, we just need... A leather now. Or... I guess we could punch grass. Punching grass might work. There's a lot of grass to punch. What is this? I kind of want to pillar up to it. Oh, sheesh. What is this? Environmental accumulator. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna assume, given that it's located here, that if I break it, I don't get to keep it. It probably has to be here. But maybe it's nice that I'm right beside one? If I had to guess, it's probably nice that this is right here. I guess I'll have to remember that. Let's see, it was, um... Wait, yeah. Yeah. Okay, um... Let's see, but we are generating squid right now. Lots of squid, and I'm really wanting... Where cap? Ooh. Just went right past some sugar cane here. There's some more in this clearing, too. Okay. Uh, maybe we go, maybe we hang out over here and wait for things to spawn. Does anything spawn? What is that? <gasps> no way. Wow, I'm so lucky. I just stumbled into this randomly. I s oh. <clears throat> I found another one of those, actually, then. I just never went into it because I was in a boat. And I was like, what is this? That's what this is. It's a meteorite impact. We have Surtis Quartz. Maybe, hopefully. Oh, we need to make a... We need to make a crate. I gotta make a box. Got all this crying obsidian. Wow. Um, okay, so... But the uninitiated, uh, what this is, is a meteorite impact. Um, I didn't know that this had already fallen. I thought, usually there's a trigger to make this fall. Um, like you find Sirtis Quartz underground, I think. But, uh, not so. 
Oh, I don't... Do I want... I guess I do. Yeah, I'm just gonna mine this. Yeah. Um, and inside of this somewhere, we hope, is... Sardis Quartz. Um, there is definitely some other stuff. Like this chest is always there. But I would love to see any Sirtis Quartz block. Any pure Sirtis Quartz? I guess not. Usually it would be at the center. Oh, well, we don't need a diamond pick for this. So we'll use a stone to find out that black stone. Oh, gold nuggets in it. Wow, a lot of gold nuggets, actually. This turns into gold. Cool. I did not realize. Well, that's neat. Nice feature. Full of gold. Gotta love that. Okay, whoops. Let's see what's in this chest. Um, okay, we got some free nether quartz. Moon, sand, cobwebs. So we didn't get any of the things that we want to get in this chest. What we're looking for in this chest are actually... It's something called a press. Um, but we did not get a press. Um, however, we're eventually going to make a meteorite compass. And because this is close to our base, we actually need to mine every single piece of this meteorite. Otherwise, it's going to wind up sending us here. So let's get digging. I was hoping we would find um, another course along the way. What, what can you do? What can you do? But hope for some nether quartz. So let's uh, dig this up. And uh, be on our way, I guess. So we're looking for cows. What we were looking for. Looking for a cow to get some leather so we can find a book. I don't see any. I think I see a villager. No. Not a villager. That's probably a skeleton. Oh, you know. I'm not hearing block pickup sounds anymore. Yeah, my bag is full. Let me go home. We got a nether quartz. <laughs> I mean, that's not too bad, I guess. And three emeralds. That's actually pretty great. I'll just shove this in here and uh, keep taking out this. We'll eventually be able to um, turn this obsidian into magma and use this for power, which will make it very, very good. So this is absolutely worth picking up in addition to the uh, other thing. But we have, um, oh, there's magma blocks even. Um, But, just the one. That'll be for a little... <clears throat> that won't be for a little while yet. We'll, uh... We'll have to wait for that. There's some more crying of sitting here. There's the Pillar of Disappointment.
to pick these up too. Yeah, I mean, that's that's a meteorite impact. That's the first one. A swing and a miss. But I think there was a second one, at least, that we could check out. Now that I recognize why water would be going down. Some floaty boys coming down to check it out. What is this uh, blue fire? What is this burning on? There's soul sand here? Whoa. Well, I guess I'm about to go to the end. But still, soul sand is pretty good. I don't have to break the blackstone. Block of coal. Okay. I like blocks of coal. So apparently there's a lot of coal here. That's neat. Can't hate on that. There's also soul soil and soul sand. I'm gonna grab these, just for good measure. Because for some reason I need those failed to create backup. I wonder why. I don't even, I don't even know why it's backing up or where to. It might be. Oh, well, I hope not. Guess we'll see. Hmm. Well, that was neat, but not exactly what we were looking for. Perhaps a cow will spawn. I did not see one. Hmm. Wait, where's my boat? Not again. What did I do with my boat? I came from over there. Guess I can just make another boat. I'm in a forest. But there's just boats everywhere. There it is. Whoops. Hmm. Well, hmm. I guess let's check a plains biome. Don't cows spawn there a lot? Or maybe grasslands? That's probably a good place to look for a plains or a grassland. Wow. That is not far. Just oh, that's a zombie. Let's uh let's not be here. Let's be the place which is not here. Going to over there. I probably don't need the beacon right next to the giant beacon in hindsight. Oh. What? I thought... It, did I misread it? I thought it was telling me to go... the other way. Hmm. I guess I went the wrong direction. Eat the, eat the beets. Why are these restoring so little food? Uh, 
Oh, I see. Well, now I am full for a long time. Just shoving tons of beets in my face. Okay, let's actually remember to take the boat. Oops. There we go. Find our way over to this plains biome then. cool looking. Like it's got teeth. So we are still 268 blocks away. So I guess it's on the other side of that gigantic cave. Wow, there's a lot of drowned. So many. All sort of gathered together. You can see them on the mini map. We can't see them here because they're very deep. But uh, yeah, definitely don't want to go diving here until we are in better shape. In which case, we absolutely want to go diving here. I bet they have stuff. But for now, let's not stay. Is it flooded? It is. It's like a flooded cave. Huge, too. Wow. Absolutely giant. Kind of want to explore it later. I'm going to mark it. Where is the base here? Oh, I zoomed out too much. There's the base. We're way to the north of it. And I guess the plains is on the other side of this. Thought we would be able to get up this way, but it doesn't look like it. I guess we're going the long way around. There's cows up there somewhere. This way. I bet we can get up there this way. high elevation for our planes that you 
here's our cows. My friend. Oh. Definitely needed that. What's up with this cow? Okay. Got some leather. Did this drop chicken? What is that? Animal fat. Oh. Oh, that's for the magic, I bet. It's like a magic system that's pretty neat. Bet that's what it's for. Let's see if I, uh, yeah, it looks like I missed something else over here. What's this? Sand chicken. It looks like sand. I wonder if it gives me sand somehow? Hmm. That's intriguing. I would like chickens that make eggs of resources or something. I'm gathering, that's probably what that is. Oh. What is this? To cause positive effects. Oh. Hmm. Maybe I should take these. Oh, I'm out of space. Uh, well, this is kind of valuable. Let me just go home. Actually, no. Let's just drop this. There's more of these. I don't know what's going on with them, but I like it. It gave me an achievement, so clearly I am meant to do something with them. We'll, uh, we'll do the Botania stuff later. Oh, no. Oh, I thought I just fell to my death. So I did not. That's good. Any more cows? I don't see any cows. Oh, it looks like there are some cows over there. Let's go west. East. <laughs> west. Uh, log chicken. Yeah, I mean, it seems like... Seems like those chickens can probably give me resources or something. I want a diamond chicken. Ooh, or an emerald chicken. That would be useful. Imagine what we could do with an emerald chicken. Okay, I know there's a particular white flower we're looking for. Or botania. I don't think it's these. But that one is quite rare. The rest of them I don't really care about. They do! They poop sand! That's hilarious. Okay, where is... Cows? Oh! Oh! <laughs> uh... Okay. There, cow. Up here. That's chickens. I like that they've added different cows. I... Hmm. 
I'm so used to the Minecraft cow, it never even occurred to me that cows are also other colors. Clearly, I have not been around cows very much. Not very much at all. Hmm. Well, we got some leather. That's really what we left for. Boom. So we got obsidian, leather, paper. We can make a book and an enchanting table. We do need a diamond, though. So we grab diamond. That way we can enchant. I need four obsidian. Yeah. Oh, wait. No, no, no. I need two diamonds. Right. And some lapis, for that matter. Enchanting table. Very cool. So, we don't have any bookshelves right now. Um, so, this is probably going to be a fairly weak enchantment, but it's better than nothing, I guess. Uh, let's see. Hmm, do we maybe make diamond gear? I guess it couldn't hurt. I mean, it could hurt. <laughs> diamond gear is kind of expensive. Hmm. Let's, uh, let's just enchant what we've got. Let's see what we can get on the enchantment table. So, sword protection, air affinity, eh. Protection is kind of neat. Uh, so bound I don't really care about. Projectile protection, protection, mana region. Mana region could be nice. Yeah, let's maybe take mana region on our boots and on our pants. Yeah. That'll be good. And um, I don't think there was anything we really wanted here. Protection, protection, and also protection. So, yeah. Let's take protection, then. Okay. So we got some mana regen. That's pretty useful. I guess that means we want our spell from earlier. I don't know how powerful it is. Uh, that one. Death by a hundred pricks. Projectile to pierce. Linger sensitive. Summon vex. Extend time. Swarm your enemies with bladed spirits. Interesting. All the users in Thailand. Huh. Well, the mana region is definitely going to help then. I see. That's where those vexes came from. Right. I remember. I was confused by that. So that's potentially helpful. Didn't cost us much experience, at least. Well, let's use the rest of the obsidian we have, and we'll build a portal. I guess not the rest of it. Okay. Let's make a big one. 
I need a, uh, a flint and steel. Do I have any flint here? Where did I put that? I'm glad that we don't need actual steel or flint and steel. That would be hard. I've just given some expert mod pack creators some devious ideas, I'm sure. Let's see. Let's build it like into the wall here. Make it like a three by three. Whoops, that's, that's fine. Whatever. Okay. So I have no idea what's going to be on the other side of the portal. So we want to make sure that we uh, definitely prepare 